Hello everyone, this is Lamin Sane of LS Web Apps and welcome back to the second video of this tutorial series which is Laravel blogging tutorial with Twitter Bootstrap. Okay, so in this video we're going to prepare the create forms which is what we're going to use to create new posts. Okay, so first thing we need to do is prepare our routes for the posts. Okay, so let's open up the routes from file which is um, located in app http routes.php so inside the um, group uh, here which has the middleware of web we're going to create one route um, resource route there so we say route colon colon resource and it's going to be post and it's going to associate it with the post controller so we say post controller we haven't created the controller yet but we're going to do so in a moment okay and the reason we put it inside the uh, web middleware is that so that it has such things as um, CSRF protection and um, that's just some protection that Laravel adds um, to your form so that you can't be easily hacked okay so next what we're going to do is create the controller now let's go to our terminal I'll just clear this yeah so we're going to say PHP artisan make controller and the controller name is going to be post controller plural and we're going to specify that it's a resource so we say dash dash resource so that it has all the methods of a resource controller press enter our controller has successfully been created let's go and see what's inside it so we've got http controller post controller and as you can see it has created a post controller and um, it has all these um, resource methods here okay so next what we're going to do is let's create our layout file so we're going to go in resources here we're going to pre create a view a blade view so let's create one folder called um, layouts and um, inside there we're going to create a master.blade.php so in there I'll just um, copy some HTML which I prepared quickly and just paste that in there I'll explain what's in all of that so basically this is just a uh, a basic HTML template and this part here is what is Laravel specific so I am linking to the Twitter bootstrap CDN CSS and the JavaScript as well since we're going to be using um, Twitter bootstrap to team the, the posts and um, the forms as well all right so um, now that we have a layout file let's go ahead and create uh, a create page for the post okay so views here let's create another folder in the views called post that is where all the post um, views are going to be located in so we say create.blade.php okay and in there I'll paste in some HTML as well so I've copied this and I paste it so um, what I've done is I've extended the master view that we have created initially which is this one and I'm creating a section which the um, master view defines which is this content se section here so inside there we're going to have h2 which just says create post so i'll just make this capital and i'm opening a form which submits to the post the store route so um let me just show you quickly all the routes that we have in our application so i'll say php artisan route list okay so all these routes have been created um when we define the post resource as shown here I'll show you quickly so this um, line here is what makes all these routes available for us okay so we are going to um, submit our create form to the post dot create route so we use the name of the route and then we have one form group which is a label for the title property of the post and we have another label and text area for the body property of the post right so these correspond to um, these table columns that we have created here, title and body. And since when we are creating, we don't need to specify an ID. They'll be created automatically. And the timestamps as well will be created automatically. All right, so back to our create.blade.php. We have a form token here, which is um, some token that is put in by Laravel so that your forms are protected when they're submitted. And we have another um, submit um, button here which will just become a regular button that you can submit your form as you can see I have added some um, CSS for Twitter bootstrap um, 
so we have a button here and um, let's go to our controller so that we can return this view from the create action and uh, we can just view it in the browser from there so inside create here I'm just going to return that view so I'll say return view and which view we're going to return is uh, post start create since um, this view here is in the post folder and uh, the name is create we're going to return that so let's go back in our browser forward slash post and then create so I press enter and we have an error it says um, on line 29 of our controller might have forgotten um, or made a mistake in spelling so return should be t-u-r-n right save that and um, refresh and it seems we have an error in our storage here it says file put contents um, it has issues storing inside the storage folder so we might have to do a mod. Um, last time I did a 755 for the storage. So it seems we had to do a 777 for the storage. And we're going to make it recursive as well. So I'll just put a dash R there for the storage folder. Enter my password and that should be fixed. Okay, so back here, when I refresh, it says HTML entities expects parameter one to be a string array given okay so inside our view post create view um, apparently made a mistake um, here should have put null in there so um, when you're creating a text input field the first um, argument that you pass in is just the name of the field the second one is the default value before the user enters anything in the field and the third one is any attributes you want to set on the field like classes and such okay so back to our browser let's refresh and the form should be shown so that brings us to the end of this um, tutorial video and in the next video we're going to see how we can actually create submit this form and accept values um, in our controller and then redirect the user to another page after that Alright, I'll see you soon in another video. Thanks for watching. Cheers. Bye-bye.